So it has been a bit of a minute since the last time I posted a video. I think I mentioned in my last video that I moved and the thing is, I'm actually moving again. I pretty much just like stayed here for the summer, so I didn't actually end up finishing this room as much as I wanted to. I don't know, I wanted to film at least one video here, so I just thought I would share with you guys my room. So I'm doing a second room tour for 2019, and honestly, when I move again, I'll probably do another one. So I'm gonna end up having like three different room tours in three different rooms for 2019, but it's all good. Let's just start at the door. So at the door, obviously, there's a door. We usually hang our coats on the back of it. Um, so right now I just have my pink denim jacket that I got from our Deans, and then I have a um, like a greenish denim jacket that I got from Joe Fresh for like 10 bucks on sale. After the door, we have Tyler's wardrobe. I kind of took the entire closet, and we didn't want to have a dresser in here just to like because I didn't want to take up like a bunch of space because I wanted to optimize this room for filming purposes even though I didn't actually film in this room but yeah so this is Tyler's wardrobe we never actually ended up putting the doorknobs on it because the doorknobs are just these little gray like buttony things that were kind of ugly so we were planning on putting other like doorknobs on it but then we just never did so this is actually going to be coming into my new room so maybe we'll end up putting the doorknobs on it then I'm not really sure yeah so that's that I think we got it I forget what it was called but we got it at Ikea for like 110 bucks or something like that. Yeah, there's a lot of like Ikea stuff in here. Beside the wardrobe is the little side table that I have. I cannot tell you where it's from because I have no idea. My mom had it and I don't know where the heck it came from. I've had it since the beginning of time and I never ended up putting anything in the little cubby underneath. I was gonna put like a camera or something in there, but then I just ran out of time. Actually, by the time you guys are watching this, I will actually be moved out, which is kind of sad and kind of crazy and kind of weird and scary all at the same time. But anyway, after the nightstand, we just have my bed. I did actually mention this in a vlog. There's actually like a million vlogs coming because I didn't upload any vlogs over the summer because life was just too crazy to edit them. So there's like a million vlogs coming about like me moving into this place. There's gonna be vlogs about me moving out and all kinds of summer adventures and stuff. But I talked about like moving in like a lot on the vlog channel. And I talked about why I kept my single bed or I guess twin bed, whatever they're called. Anyway, instead of getting like a double bed because me and Tyler both moved in here. And the reason for that is basically just A, I didn't have the money to buy a new bed and B, I wanted the small bed because I wanted to optimize space for filming, like I said before. I wanted enough space to set up my lights and my tripod and like my slider and everything if I needed it. And that's why we kept the little bed back there. But uh, as you guys already know, this is the only video I'll ever film in here, which is kind of sad. I took the wall collage off of the wall of my old room and I plan to put it on the wall behind me. But as again, you can see that that never got finished as well. Every time I tried to put it up, it was just too freaking hot. And then like we decided we weren't gonna stay here. So then I was like, well, I'm not gonna bother putting this up all over the whole wall if we're not staying here. So the wall collage is going to move again to the next room and hopefully I'll actually finish it there. After the wall collage disaster, we have the section where my TV is. I got the little TV stand at the bottom from Ikea and then I realized that it was too short. I can't remember the name of it, but if like I can find these things on Ikea again, I'll link them down below for you guys in case you're interested in purchasing them. But yeah, it was too short. I like I had this other thing in mind and then it was gonna be like way too big and then we were just walking around Ikea and I was like oh maybe this will work and Tyler was like yeah it'll be perfect and then we brought it home and I was like whoa way too freaking short so then I brought I bought this three cube shelf from Giant Tiger for like 20 bucks I think and then I put my cameras in it and then we could put the TV on the top the TV is just the same TV that I had in my old room in my old room it was actually wall mounted and I didn't want to drill a bunch of holes in the walls here because they had just been repainted when we moved in so I just sat it on top of that and I put the stand back on it and beside the TV we just have like my little makeup station because I used to do my makeup and I used to leave my makeup on my dresser but again I didn't bring my dresser and I didn't have a mirror so I stole this long mirror from my parents house. Well, I didn't steal it. I asked my mom if I could have it and she said yes. And then of course I have like my like circle mirror that like magnifies your face which is kind of scary sometimes because you can just see everything. Highly recommend but at the same time it can be a little scary. On that little like circle table I got from like Superstore like several years ago. It's been in so many videos. I used to do like DIYs on top of it and stuff. I just have like all my makeup and stuff and half of it's on the floor and then my straightener is underneath because that's just kind of where I do all of that stuff because I don't like to do it in the bathroom because I don't want to take up like 
you know, like there's like five of us that share the bathroom. So I do, I don't like to do that stuff in the bathroom because, well, I don't want to take up the bathroom for a long amount of time. Then we come over to my desk. There's actually a window um, right before the desk, but we'll start with the desk. So the desk is a $30 desk from Ikea. It's the same desk for my old room. And then I kind of have like the same, like if you guys watch my 2019 room tour, like I posted in like January or February or something like that. I have pretty much the same desk set up. My computer is on it in the clips that you're watching now, um, but I do have like my Rocket 5 speakers, my lamp, and then my MIDI keyboard, and then I also have my little Google Home, which I never plugged in since I moved in here. So, yeah, so that's pretty much just like my desk area, and then of course we have the window, and this is just like the view outside my window. There's lots of nice, beautiful trees, and I'm kind of sad to be leaving that view because it's really pretty, honestly. After the desk, my guitar is just sitting on the floor there because I like to pick it up every once in a while and just practice a little bit, do a little bit of writing and stuff, and then you get to my closet, which doesn't actually have, well, I think the closet the doors are in the basement but we never actually ended up putting them on so it's just kind of open to the world I know it's a little bit scary and it's a little bit messy and a little bit crazy but that's my closet and that's pretty much all I'm gonna say about that and then behind the door we have a little table that we brought here the night that we moved in because we wanted to set the TV on it because we didn't have a TV stand yet and yeah that is pretty much my entire room this is the room that I've lived in um, for the summer and it was pretty sweet I have a lot of memories in this house even though I was only here for like two months um, but yeah it was a fun time it was a wild ride at times yeah I'm glad I lived here for even a little bit it was a fun little experience and I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour. I haven't posted a video in a little while and I know a lot of you guys have been patiently waiting. Cough, Gina, cough. I know you've been waiting to see this room, so here you go. This is my room tour. Um, more videos are going to be coming soon. I'm going to be posting, I think, once a month. I mean, not once a month. Once a week for September and then hopefully twice or even three times a week in October because October videos are just like my favorite to film. So leave any comments down below if you want any DIY costumes or like just specific like fall or Halloween content because I'm in the process of planning that right now. So make sure to leave those in the comments down below. And yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Go ahead and check out my vlog channel if you want to see all the stories behind moving and moving out and my summer adventures because I'm hopefully gonna be posting a vlog every day until I catch up. I literally just posted a vlog from June 21st and the day that I'm filming this it is September 3rd. A solid two months worth of vlogs is coming soon. Well they should be in the process of being posted now. I guess we'll see. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys very soon in the next video. Hopefully next Friday. So I will see you guys then. Bye!